Hey guys, what is up? This is Moogle Master 102, and today we are doing another Let's Play in, on Board of Hell. And this time it's Top Gear, one of my favorite games on the Super Nintendo as a kid. I fucking love this game. So here, uh, we're gonna go for one player, make her name. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, so this is Top Gear. One of the best racing games ever. No other racing will, will, no other racing game will ever be as good as Top Gear. I don't care what you guys say. Burnout, Need for Speed, friggin' the other games like that. Nothing, nothing compared to this game. I don't care. And here I picked the white car because it has the lowest uh, fuel consumption, and we're playing in LA, um, in the USA circuit, which we're currently on. But anyway, um, yeah. Playing as a white car because I just burped. <laughs> um, playing as a white car because it has the lowest fuel consumption. Um, the reason why I picked it because of that and the fact that it's it's a normal car basically, and you know, I, I just think it's cool looking. <laughs> yeah, um, I picked this car because of the low fuel consumption and it's easy. It's probably the easiest car to use considering you know. Most of the, some of the track, some of the later tracks in this game are incredibly long, and you'll be running out of your fuel pretty fast. Um, and I don't want to do that that often, so I just picked the car and you know, just went along with it, you know. And here we're here. Uh, you got to be aware of the tight turns. Now I have a trick when you're uh, going with the tight turns: try and uh, you know press like repeatedly press the accelerate button. And, uh, it will actually help your turning a little bit. Now, remember, it doesn't work, like, perfectly, but it's a good strategy. Though sometimes the computer can be a dickhead and do something stupid to you, and that was a pretty fast track. <laughs> yeah. So we came first. We got 20 points. And here we're playing in Los, uh, Los Angeles. And we're gonna play in LA in the USA circuit. Obviously, that's the circuit we're on. Now, um, later tracks in this game, I do get my ass kicked, so, well, a bit. I don't come in first in every race. I'm gonna let you know that right now because I am not very good at this game. I played a lot as a kid, but I lost the whole uh, experience, you know, playing it. But, um, before you do or say anything or put any comments saying, Oh, Brad, you suck at this game. I'll be like, I haven't played this game in forever, so fuck off. Yeah. But, um, I actually have been playing this game quite a bit, and I thought, hey, why not do a Let's Play on it? I already have all four of the uh, circuits done. I think I have one more to do. But, eh, hey, why not? It's worth a fun try. Now, be aware I am uh, doing post commentary because I don't like, you know, live commentary. I don't. I've been having problems with that, actually, too. Whenever I do record, I end up, like, screwing up majorly. Um, I don't know, that's just me. And my videos for the emulators aren't going to be in HD anymore currently because I don't really like doing that at all. Um, I don't know, Camtasia's been giving me problems with that. Like, whenever I render my videos in HD, and then it looks all unprofessional if I do that anyway. And with Bored as Hell on its uh, way, I... I don't know. That's going to have to change a bit. Bored as Hell will still be going. I don't know how many episodes it's going to be every season. In fact, I don't even think I should put them in seasons, but, uh, why not? It's like a little TV show, basically for you guys, for me. And Bored as Hell is a Let's Play, rant, blog, thingy, my bobber, put together. <laughs> I don't think I've ever mentioned that to you guys at all, um, but now I did. And here we come in first. We win, and we're in the world ranking as one. And this is probably one of my favorite levels in the entire game. I fucking love it. It's so beautiful looking. Like, look at this. It's nighttime. Like, like look at how beautiful it is. Like, even for for 1992, they 
freaking Camco did a great job at like modeling the cars, the, like the level design, the, the headlights too, like the, the design of it. It looks so beautiful on this game. It, it's awesome. I think it's a really cool idea what they did. They definitely did a great job with this. Um, as you can see, we're just completely annihilating this track. Um, but this one's my favorite. Um, no, no many known issues here. Just, you know, just an average track that looks like one of those totem things from, uh, Mario Land 2. Yeah, anyway. So here we have some nasty turns. You want to be careful not to, like, drive into the signs, because they'll slow you down. And here I did the whole acceleration tapping trick, and it actually works fairly well. Um, you want to be aware though, the later levels do have some nasty U-turns, so you might want to use that to your advantage, or at least break quite often when you're racing. Same thing with Top Gear 2. That game just has the nastiest tracks you'll ever play in a video game. Considering, you know, it's a Super Nintendo game. <laughs> And you're not going to be used to the turns at all. Yeah. So you're only turning on a 360 radius, so you can't really, can't really do much about it. Oh, sorry, 180 radius, I guess. Do you consider that? Considering the angles you're turning in? Yeah. So here I kept hitting cars, and this idiot kept passing me. Well, the AI, I should say. I should just make the name idiot and see what happens. I'd probably make my day. But here I ran out of nitro, so I had to be careful not to hit any more of the cars. Because that asshole got ahead of me. And as you can see, you know, we had a lot of fun there. Now, this next level, San Francisco, is a bitch. Why? Because it's so long. And that's the main issue in this game. You have to fuel up. A lot, and I mean a lot. Like the later levels in this, you probably have to fuel up like twice every race. I mean, there's one level where you have to fuel up like probably four, because of how, considering how freaking long it is. Um, but this level's not that bad. Not not as bad as the other ones. I'm gonna let you know that right now. No, this level has some major flaws in it. And my video lagged there, so I didn't know what was going on. Yeah. So as you can see, we come. I, I just completely just boosted up the first, like no problem whatsoever. And uh, in a little bit, the video is going to be set uh, sped up because um, I wanted to save time. And the fact that it's just like you're not really missing anything because yeah. So one, two, three. Yeah, there you go. It sounds actually pretty cool. Yeah, um, all I can say that this track is really long. It's probably the longest that I've ever played in. I don't know. Later tracks, like, when you're playing in, like, uh, the other one, uh, what is it? I can't remember. Um, I think the next one, you'll see. Um, they're really nice looking. I like the backdrops and all the other tracks. Like, it's really nice. It's kind of like Cruising Worlds. And that game was really good too, though it wasn't one of my favorites. <clears throat> I like a lot of racing games. That's just me though. <laughs> Planning to get F Zero done too. Oh, here we go. See, normal. Now here, as you can see, the computer decides to go and fuel up at the longest time. Don't ever do that, because when you're on the final lap and you do that, you're fucked. Because if if you like. If you use your nitrous to your advantage, you can actually catch up pretty easily, but, you know, considering that you, uh, fuel up on the final lap, it's just not smart. Don't ever do that. Um, but here, didn't really happen, because obviously I'm not stupid enough to do something like that. And here, I didn't really care too much about fueling up, because I have plenty more fuel to go another lap. That's what I usually think to myself. Do I have enough fuel to go through another lap on this track? Like, you gotta think about that. Like, this, it requires a lot of thinking when you're playing this game. If, if you're gonna actually end up, you know, making it as far as you can make it. 
you want to be careful with that, because sometimes the game can be pretty challenging at times when it comes to that. So here, I come in first, <laughs> and uh, it was pretty easy, actually. Now, you know, you're not going to see that too often, because the tracks are pretty tough. Like, the next, uh, the next world circuit that's coming up. So, on to the next country, are we? Now, if you want to try this, uh, next country out, the password is Moonbat. Yeah. Real lame, eh? Alright. So, I'll see you next time, guys, for another episode of Top Gear. Bye-bye!